when you're around the right people, so I came with my team, my, my close mates and uh, my trainer, so they, they're here knowing what, what the job is, we know what we have to do, so um, that, help, that helps to keep you grounded and to help you keep focused, so it's pretty straightforward. I've been here for a few hours now, um, everything's picking up, but all I'm thinking about is making sure that I am ready to perform in front of you guys, so um, it's good so far, man, I can't complain. I think, I think for me, I kind of... I just think about performing and making sure whatever I do is executed, like it's, it's well done, do you know what I mean? So um, that's what I kind of dwell on and that's what I think about. But I must remember to enjoy the journey as well. We're always thinking about the destination, but if I can enjoy the journey, then we'll be good. Every time I fight, I, I see it as an opportunity to, to sell myself, to display the skills or talents or whatever it is that I think I have. So again, this is a big stage, it's a big opportunity for me to, to show this part of the world what I fight like, what my style is like, what I bring to the table. So um, again, good opportunity and I've, I've prepared well for it. I, I don't really overthink things. We're going to be in the same room, two hands, two legs, given a set of boxing gloves, the bill will ring and you fight. So I try not to complicate things at all. Yeah, it's not in London, it's not in England, I understand that, but it's still a ring. Um, it's someone trying to hurt you and you've got to get them before they get you. The, the most pressure I'm putting on my, on the most pressure that exists is the one that I'm putting on myself. So I know what people think. I try not to read too much into it because when you get in the ring, a reputation or whatever is not going to help you. You've got to do the thing yourself, do you know what I mean? So, so I have that pressure on myself to make sure I perform, that I win and that I get to the heights that I should get to. Um, and that's kind of what I dwell on. It's like all within myself, everything I'm thinking about is me and I'm telling myself, listen bro, you got to do this, you got to do that, you got to do that. So that pressure's on myself, from myself. You hear when people you know, say you're a good fighter, you're going to do this, you're going to do that. But never let it get to your head because you don't want to be someone that should have, could have done something. I actually want to do it. So when people say that, I'm like, listen, we hope so. Let's hope that I make it. Let's hope that it happens. Do you know what I mean? Step at a time. For me, every fight is an opportunity that I have to perform well. So I, I can't, I've never thought, ah, oh, you're fighting in London today. It doesn't matter how you, how you perform. Nah, every time I'm in there, I'm like, good opportunity, Josh. Take advantage of it. So I, I, don't, I don't think, whether it's M MSG or it's at the Oto Arena, for me, it's a big opportunity. So I've got to take it. Yeah, I've got to take it. He's bringing a lot of world experience to the table. Um, he's been in with a lot of world champions. He's falling short, he's beating some, but again, that, he's bringing that world-class experience and it's for me to unlock the code.